Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Anna. I'm an investment advisor and today I would like to give you like advice how to feel safer and how to grow without any um, awful attempts. You should think about the basis, the financial uh, like airbag. And then if you have this, you would understand that you start living not the same uh, way as it was earlier. For example, you start being more calm. You know that you have some amount of money and that in any situation, everything would be okay because you have your own real estate, for example, you have something that is not connected with uh, financial crises, for example, because if we talk about, for example, property increases, uh, the rent can be, uh, so if you rent something and you don't have money, then you would not be able to earn the same uh, house as you can now. And so uh, that is why I can recommend you to diversify your uh, portfolio uh, because uh, different financial markets react differently in uh, different crises. I wrote like research and after uh, maybe I will make a video about this, but I wrote about uh, the um, behavior of financial different different investment markets in uh, crises and so I uh, found like tendency that uh, different markets they have something similar but uh, there are some moments that are different and for example it is not a good idea actually to invest all your money on stock market because in all crises it goes down very often and so that is why I can recommend you to have a diversified budget. If you have uh, such uh, approach and you know uh, inside of you that you have financial uh, opportunity not to work as hard or you are ready to some risks then it is easier for you to grow so when we have the good uh, basis then it is easier for us to grow uh, thinking about uh, uh, the moment that everything would be okay. For example, for us, uh, for people, uh, the support of our family can be important, but also financial opportunity to lose something, but not, but you would know that you would not lose anything. And so it is a way for you to start growing because you would uh, know that I can um, go to some risks, I can change my profession or I can change the boss and the company, but to be, um, to earn more, I need to uh, not to have like debt or some obligatory from others and financial um, budget that is uh, in uh, different financial markets like gold, um, diamonds, real estate, it helps you to stay strong and be uh, sure in yourself. Um, you, don't, you don't need to it is very awful thing if you take too much debt than you can afford uh, and a lot of uh, uh, owners of businesses 
uh, told about uh, some problems that they had, for example, when uh, uh, the crisis of uh, the, the 20, uh, two, 2008 uh, happened, uh, some um, people uh, like milliardaires, uh, millionaires, uh, billionaires, they lost a lot not only because of the market but because of they have too much uh, obligatories and so you shouldn't take too much uh, uh, debt and obligatories um, to uh, be uh, able to grow you should go to risk but not too much and uh, again uh, you shouldn't forget about the fact that if you have uh, like some moments in your life real estate uh, car and uh, something that is material material that you can see then uh, you would later be not mm, angry you would not need uh, so much to mm, like eat it is like food so when you are want to eat too much then you would not be um, rational you would not uh, mm, be so calm because you always want like to eat food and if we talk about money it is the same so if you are such kind of person that is already satisfied of his life and you have some items um, for example if you uh, started your own startup for example and it uh, uh, gave a lot of uh, profit opportunities and etc for example you was one of the owner of startup that is very successful then uh, in situation if you don't take some it is like cash out it names cash out if you don't make this and you don't have anything you would not be so uh, rational and uh, correct uh, making decisions after so uh, firstly this hunger can give you motivation to work as hard as it can be and at some step of your business it will help your business to grow but after some point you should start thinking uh, uh, not the same and you can think uh, about uh, global growth of your business more global growth only if you are not hungry itself so if you have everything all money only in this business then if this business become bankrupt then you would lose anything and but if you cash out for example then you would take some money from your business and uh, if you take some dividends from your business then you would not be hungry and you would know that oh i have already i everything have i really want to grow this business because i really like it i want to build something uh, extremely uh, successful and if you have such approach then uh, your decisions would be sometimes more risky so uh, if you are not hungry now so you have as a person everything then after you would not think that oh it will be the, the worst thing if i lose the mo some money of this business and in some uh, step of your of running your own business you start thinking that Oh, maybe we shouldn't go there maybe we shouldn't risk so much or maybe we don't really need so uh, such development of this business because you start uh, thinking only about your money and how to save them and they are all in your business and that is why it can uh, decrease the effectiveness of the whole team 
of your of, of you as a owner one of the owner of business and uh, uh, you should develop uh, your business your career and some assets like investments where you like keep your money and maybe earn a bit and this will help you to grow there because you will be sure that even if something goes wrong here I would have something uh, here because everything is calm here. I diversified portfolio. I bought a lot of items that are from alternative investments, not only stocks and bonds. And you would be more um, risky there because you have the basis where you can uh, stand strong and this leads to better results in the future because the money that you can earn because of your career you shouldn't all put again in your business because again uh, you should diversify and something can go wrong the business can go bankrupt and uh, the bankruptcy of your business is not the bankruptcy of yourself you should understand that you and your business is not the same you are not equal business and very often uh, businessmen they have problem with this so they think that they are a business but in reality i, I know i feel uh, the same but uh, i run my own like brand and reputation that is why my brand my face my uh, knowledge and my um, opportunities are the same as like business so i'm not the business itself i'm like a brand so that is why i can think that i am my business because i am my brand <laughs> i am a brand of myself but if we talk about some organizations some businesses that have different uh, another name not your name it is not your brand it is something where you are like the owner of your like entrepreneur or where you're like investor then you shouldn't think uh, that you are that business you should think that business is okay he can grow and i should be safe too and so that is why you should it is important it is really important it is a very awful mistake that some people uh does and then they uh suffer from it because something goes wrong and they have nothing and that is why it is extremely important that is why i say you this and i'm sure i would like to give you like uh help it is only because i really think that it is big problem you should take some money not so much money from your business but you should take it and put it into your own budget in your own like package into your and uh, this will help you to stay uh, wealthy to be uh, to live in normal conditions even if uh, something goes wrong there and uh, that is why you should know how to register everything correctly because for example there are a lot of cases when the whole uh, uh, assets were bought in uh, organization the money of organization you are like owner but money was uh, you, you're um, connected with law on that company and it helps not to pay so much taxes but it is not your own the if you talk about documents the uh, uh, that what a business has is not the same that you have and it is documentary so you can use some of these assets for example you can use i don't know car that you bought for your business because you're the owner of business or you can uh, uh, use um, some property but um, in reality if you lose your business um, and it can happen uh, then uh, you would have nothing from this and that is why you should take some money from your business even if you should um, uh, pay taxes then but you should think about yourself about your children and there are a lot of um, moments instruments how to do it 
uh, more profitably. I will tell you about this more if uh, you need it, so uh, you, you will know me for life, so I uh, make a lot of videos and uh, I can... Uh, well, you, you, so if you need it uh, maybe in the future or if you know me uh, personally then you can uh, um, write for example in comments uh, some questions and I will try to help but so it is very important moment that you should uh, remember that um, buying uh, alternative investments like gold physical gold like diamonds like property not makes you happy itself but you will feel more calm and it will give you opportunity to grow so i hope that you like this video don't forget to subscribe see you later bye bye